of the Adiren Ikiti project. I am sure it will have a positive impact on the upliftment of the women and youth in the Kiti state. Your Excellency, I'm available to lend my support and expertise. And I'm just a phone call. Congratulations, Your Excellency. Thank you very much. Um, Our Royal Majesty, Honorary Adirunke Ogmuisi, our beautiful Honorary, you are welcome to our midst. The representative of the week. Number 12, the launch of Adi Red, the up will be done by uh, the Honorary of Ife. So we should prepare for that. But for now, welcome, His Excellency. Thank you, Your Excellency, Mr. Governor. Thank you, Your Excellency. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. I declare it open. at uh, the program here this afternoon. Uh, what can you say about this and what does it present for the, the culture of Yoruba land? I'm just, I'm so excited because um, as you may know, I'm one of the promoters of Adire, one of the gatekeepers of Adire. And what is being done here today, you know, just will help you know, keep preaching the gospel about our heritage fabric, you know, preservation of our, uh, our culture, our heritage, but doing it in a fashion, fashionable way with our textiles. Because Adira is who we are. It belongs to the Yoruba people. And as I mentioned earlier, Adira means Adi, Are, 
and it's been an old age craft, you know, that Yoruba women have practiced over thousands of years ago. So I am super, super excited. Oh, your word of advice for the beneficiaries? Um, my word of advice for the beneficiaries is not to take, you know, the offer being given to them for granted. And um, like His Excellency said, even if they're not making any money from it right now, you know, they should think of the future. Adira is a very lucrative business if they put their mind to it. So it's all about mindset. It's not about what they can benefit now, but it's looking, you know, what they can gain in the future and setting their mind, you know, and not taking advantage of the opportunity given to them now. Thank you. Thank you.